For centuries, we've gazed at the stars, our eyes searching the vast darkness above, filled with wonder and hope. United by a single, timeless question, are we alone in this immense universe? This curiosity has connected generations, inspiring stories, dreams, and scientific quests. Today, August 10, 2025, that question may finally have an answer. The world holds its breath as history unfolds before our eyes. The James Webb Space Telescope has detected something extraordinary. A faint signal, a cosmic whisper from the depths of space that could change everything we thought we knew. This isn't just a scientific milestone, it's a turning point for humanity, a moment that will echo through generations. The journey to this moment began with our relentless curiosity and the creation of Webb, a telescope designed to peer deeper into the universe than ever before, built by thousands of dedicated minds over decades. Its mission, to uncover the origins of the cosmos, to search for signs of life beyond Earth, and to answer questions that have haunted humanity for millennia. But sometimes, the universe surprises us with answers we never expected, revealing mysteries that challenge our imagination. The discovery we're about to explore isn't just data, it's a revelation that could reshape our understanding of life itself and our place in the cosmos. The news has sent shockwaves around the globe, challenging our beliefs, igniting our imagination, and uniting us in awe and curiosity. For the first time, we have evidence that the ingredients for life exist far beyond our blue planet, scattered across the universe in places we never dreamed possible. This is not science fiction. This is real. The boundaries between imagination and reality are blurring before our eyes. So what did Webb find? What secrets did the universe finally reveal to us after all these years of searching? And what does it mean for all of us? How will this discovery shape our future, our dreams, and our understanding of what it means to be human? Let's journey together into the story that may redefine our place in the universe and open a new chapter in the epic tale of humanity. The James Webb Space Telescope is humanity's most ambitious eye on the cosmos. Built to see in infrared, Webb can peer through cosmic dust and glimpse the universe's earliest moments. Launched in 2021, it traveled a million miles to its post at L2, where it remains shielded and cold, perfect for its sensitive instruments. Its golden segmented mirror and tennis court-sized sunshield are marvels of engineering. Webb's four scientific instruments work together to capture images and spectra, revealing the composition and motion of distant worlds. Its mission to study the first light, the birth of stars and planets, and the potential for life on exoplanets. For years, Webb has scanned the skies, searching for the chemical fingerprints of life. Now that search has paid off. The discovery that has captured the world's attention began with a simple question. What's out there? And Webb has just given us a stunning answer. Webb's purpose is simple yet profound, to see the unseen. Its infrared vision lets it capture the faintest light from the universe's earliest stars and galaxies, light that's traveled over 13 billion years. By staring at tiny patches of sky, Webb reveals thousands of galaxies in a space no bigger than a grain of sand held at arm's length. It also peers into stellar nurseries, watching stars and planets being born behind veils of dust. Most captivating of all, Webb studies exoplanets, analyzing starlight that filters through their atmospheres. By breaking down this light, scientists search for biosignatures, gases like oxygen, methane, and water vapor. During one such observation, Webb found something extraordinary. The search for life had just taken a giant leap forward. The discovery began quietly, almost like a secret being passed through the darkness as data streamed from the James Webb Space Telescope to Earth. In the stillness of the mission control room, a sense of anticipation hung in the air, unnoticed by the world outside. On July 19, 2025, Dr. Evelyn Reed's team focused their attention on Kepler, 186F, an Earth-sized planet orbiting in the habitable zone of its cool, red sun. The planet had long been a subject of speculation, but tonight, it was the center of the scientific universe. Using Webb's powerful NIRSPEC instrument, the team began a detailed analysis of the planet's atmosphere. They expected to find the usual suspects, water vapor, carbon dioxide, and methane, gases that hint at the possibility of life, but nothing more. But as the data came in, they found those familiar signatures, and something entirely unexpected. Complex absorption lines appeared, the unmistakable fingerprints of organic molecules, eerily similar to chlorophyll, the pigment that makes life on Earth possible. On Earth, chlorophyll is the engine of photosynthesis, capturing sunlight and turning it into energy for plants. 
To find its analog on a distant world was not just surprising, it was revolutionary, a moment that would redefine our understanding of life in the universe. The signal was not faint or ambiguous, it was strong, persistent, and consistent with a planetary scale process. Photosynthesis, but not as we know it. It hinted at a world teeming with life, transforming its atmosphere on a grand scale. For weeks, the team worked tirelessly, checking and rechecking their data, running simulations and ruling out every other possible explanation. The weight of their findings pressed on them, knowing what was at stake. The evidence became undeniable. Kepler 186F's atmosphere contained molecules that, as far as we know, only living organisms can produce. The implications were staggering, and the excitement in the lab was electric. At a historic press conference, Dr. Reed announced, We have found a chemical signature that can only be explained by a widespread biological process. The world listened, breathless, as the news spread across the globe. This wasn't just evidence of microbial life hiding in the shadows. The signal pointed to a thriving biosphere, one that was actively transforming its planet, much as Earth's forests and oceans have shaped our own world. The pigments detected were tuned to absorb the deep red light of their sun, a stunning example of evolution adapting to alien conditions. Life, it seemed, had found a way to flourish under a different sky. The timeline of discovery became history in the making. July 19, the first observation. August 1st, confirmation after rigorous analysis. August 10th, the world learned that we are not alone in the universe. The universe, it seems, is alive with possibility. Each star a beacon of hope, each planet a potential cradle for life. This is more than a scientific discovery. It's the opening of a new chapter in the story of life itself, a chapter that will be written by generations to come. The implications are profound, touching every field from biology to philosophy. We are only beginning to grasp what this means for our understanding of life, intelligence, and our place in the cosmos. Humanity's place in the cosmos has changed forever. We are no longer just observers. We are participants in a universe that is richer, stranger, and more alive than we ever imagined. What did Webb actually see? For years, astronomers have dreamed of peering into the atmospheres of distant worlds, hoping to find the faintest hint of life. Now, with the James Webb Space Telescope, that dream has become reality. Using a technique called transmission spectroscopy, Webb measured the starlight filtering through Kepler, 186F's atmosphere as the planet passed in front of its star. This allowed scientists to search for telltale absorption lines, unique fingerprints left by different molecules. The team expected to find water vapor and carbon dioxide, the basic ingredients for life as we know it, and indeed they found both, confirming the planet's potential for habitability. But the real breakthrough came with the detection of a series of sharp, unmistakable absorption lines from complex organic molecules, which the team dubbed aerophils. These molecules, similar in function to chlorophyll on Earth, appear to be specially adapted to absorb the red and infrared light emitted by Kepler, 186F's cooler, dimmer star. The signal was so strong, so clear, that it suggests a vast portion of the planet's surface is covered in photosynthetic life, alien plants thriving in an environment very different from our own. Dr. Eris Thorne, a leading astrobiologist, called it the holy grail of exoplanet science. We've gone from finding potentially habitable planets to finding one that is almost certainly inhabited. The data implies a biosphere actively shaping its world, just as life on Earth has transformed our own atmosphere and surface over billions of years. Imagine a landscape not of green but of deep red or black vegetation, stretching beneath an orange sky, bathed in the glow of a distant, cooler sun. This is no longer just speculation or wishful thinking, it's a scientific hypothesis grounded in direct, observable evidence. Kepler, 186F, is a living world, orbiting its star 500 light-years from our solar system, a beacon of life in the vastness of space. The discovery redefines what we know about life in the universe, expanding our understanding of where and how life can thrive. It's a breathtaking glimpse into an alien ecosystem, thriving in the light of another sun, with forms and colors beyond our imagination. The search for life beyond Earth has now become the study of life itself, as we begin to unravel the mysteries of these distant worlds. And in this moment, the universe feels a little less lonely as we realize we may not be alone after all. The news of life on Kepler 186F has united the world in awe. Leaders from every nation have called for global cooperation and a new era of space exploration. 
The United Nations is convening to establish international protocols for future research. Web itself is a symbol of partnership built by NASA, ESA, and CSA. Now there's talk of building even more powerful telescopes to directly image Kepler 186F. But new challenges arise. Who decides the next steps? How do we avoid competition and conflict? The discovery is a mirror reflecting our need for unity and stewardship. It reminds us that habitable worlds are rare and precious. Our response to this moment will define us as a species. The economic impact is immediate. A surge in investment innovation and ambition. Aerospace and tech industries are booming as companies and nations race to develop new tools for deep space exploration. Private spaceflight is accelerating, with Mars no longer the only goal. The dream, to one day send probes to Kepler 186F. New industries are emerging, from astrobiology to AI-driven data analysis. But the costs are immense, and tough choices lie ahead. The rewards, new knowledge, technology, and inspiration are incalculable. Humanity has opened a new economic frontier, and the race is on. The discovery of life on Kepler 186F challenges our deepest beliefs. It suggests life is not a cosmic fluke, but a common outcome. Humanity is no longer the universe's only actor. We're part of a much larger story. Religions and philosophies will grapple with this new reality, sparking reflection and dialogue. The Fermi paradox deepens. Life is common, but intelligent civilizations may be rare. Seti's search is now more focused than ever. Above all, this discovery is a source of hope. It reminds us the universe is alive with potential and wonder. We are all children of the cosmos, united by curiosity. The story of life is bigger than any one world. We stand at a crossroads illuminated by the light of a living world far away. The discovery on Kepler 186F is just the beginning. A call to explore, to dream, to unite. The next steps will demand global collaboration, innovation, and a commitment to peaceful discovery. We must inspire the next generation to carry this torch forward. This is our Apollo moment, a challenge that can unite us all. The universe has whispered, we are not alone. This knowledge gives us new purpose and hope. Our journey to the stars has just begun. Let's embrace this moment together as one people on one planet. The cosmos is alive and so is our future.